Hi everyone. It's Kev's My Pies YouTube channel. Welcome back to another AFL W Teacher Review video. And today we're going to be reviewing the round five win against the Melbourne Demons. Uh, what a win that was. Um, to be honest, we're undefeated. Um, it felt really good to. Um, to watch, to be there, to be able to watch the game and to see how we went about it. To keep Melbourne goalless for three quarters, of course if they quarter they did win because they kicked a the goal. Um, we had our chances in that. So I think what well, does show that we can be a very good team and hopefully it does work out like that for us. But Mate, it, it feels good. Um, there's a couple of things I need to say on that thing. Um, I didn't record it um, at the time because my way is thinking the, the way it's easy for me to get to Victoria Park is by catching two trains. So you can either get off at Parliament Station and catch the train. Or you can get off at Melbourne Central to catch another train to get towards Victoria Park. And all you have to do is walk. But that didn't happen. Had to catch a replacement bus. Caught the 246 bus back. Got off at Richmond Station. Caught the train back to, to Nari. And caught the bus to know on station and got the bus home. So that didn't help. I was there to witness the whole game. Um, but I have to say, I fucking love these girls. Like, in, like I get on the game, I fucking love these girls. They mean so much. To see us win like we did with 35 points, that was a fucking win. That is nearly a 40 point belting against the Demons, who I rate as a top 16 potentially outside that top six. And and, and we won. We, we won. Um, I don't know what else to say. It, it's. It, it was a bloody good win. I fucking loved it. I really did. It's that the the happiness, the joy to <coughs> excuse me to to witness that victory meant so much. My second game. My second game of going there, we won. C c compared to last year. Now, last year I went to um, three games. It was two wins and one loss. It was a, a very good performance. It, it, it was yesterday. And to see us, we beat the West Coast Eagles. We beat Carlton, which I went to, um, and and they were free. But to, it, that now it's ten dollars and, and entry. And I have to say, there are much more improvements in these girls. I cannot believe it. I, I'm full of emotions at the moment. I just, I, I just can't believe that how well we played for three quarters. And when Melbourne kicked that goal, we could. Easily, easily shit the bed a little bit and no one can get on the run. But they didn't. And they had they had their chances. Uh that's I think so it's at rear if we kick a cuff on that third corner. I, I I'm thinking fuck how good of a win this was. We deserve to win. But 
This one, this one meant so much. And for me to yell out, I'll kill and you're supposed to be, you know, you're supposed to be a good star, but you're not. You know, you, you, you sort of expect the Melbourne to fight back, and they're coming off a loss, as much as I respect them. But on this video today that I'm doing, it's it was something ridiculous that, that, ha that I've not seen for a very long time. And I think because her forward line, like Chloe Malloy, three goals. Wow, Brianna David, two goals, and she had a very good game. Um, Stacey Livingston down in defence, doing a really, really good job. And, and she's one of the best defenders in the league at playing at full back. Ruby Slosher, I, I think she's the best running defender at half back. Maybe she, she should be in the All Australian team for the women's. She also Stacey Livingston, she also Chloe Malloy, she also Brianna Davey. I mean, these girls put in their fucking all yesterday to get the job done. I just cannot believe it. We won three quarters. Melbourne kicked a point in that first quarter. The second quarter, we went nuts. And, and Melbourne missed their opportunities. In the third quarter, we missed two behinds. And they kicked the goal. That the first fucking goal... In the last quarter, we're just peppering the goals and, and we got the result that we really needed to. Um, but it was a really good win by our girls. I, 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 I often do say this, um, nothing but love and respect for these girls. Um, coming out, watching them play, I thought if we can play f four quarters of good 40, I think that's good. But I got one of my predictions right. Brianna David had to kick about a go because she kicked two. It's always a bonus. And then for climbing why I said she'll kick out and have 12 possessions. I have to have a look at the stats on that and Brianna David because I mentioned them two in particular. Wow, three goals. Two goals in the first half. In the second half she went nuts. So I think I, th I think we can see what the women are trying to do. Our game plan is stacking up really well. It really has. It's shown that our way of going forward, I think if we do that in the men's, we will win more games than we lose. I think that. I really do think that. And the way that we have played, I think that you can tell that, we, that on our day, we can beat any team in the competition. Now, we got the Western Bulldogs coming up, and yes, we should celebrate the win now, but the Bulldogs had a day extra break compared to us. We only had a full week, so we need to prepare for this, the way we played against the Western Bulldogs. Now, they are a quick attacking team too, so we're going to have to stand up. Now, I'm not going to talk about the previews yet because it's too far Today's a Monday. So, I just wanted to, to say that that was a very good win by girls. The way we play is the way we need to go forward. The way our defence stood up, the way that we strangled the demons, ball movement, and the way that we put a lot of pressure on them to force them into mistakes after mistake after mistake. I think that was a really good win. Um... So, for that win, I'm going to give the girls, and I like to give them a rating out of 10 on this one. But I'm going to give them a 10 out of 10. Oh, I think that was a really good win. To just... Now, I've given the girls 9 out of 10. This is going to be the first 10 out of 10 performance. And the reason why I say that is because we, we played well from the start. We, to keep them goalers and the way that we forced Melbourne into a lot of mistakes and we strangled them and we kept the ball in our forward half um, sometimes the ball can come out far too easily against us we took the next step 
yesterday and I think that was a, a really good point that I needed to say because if we didn't do that Melbourne would win if we allow Melbourne to get out of our pressure and to continue to get the ball forward it's going to put a lot of pressure on our defenders so what a win by the girls what a, a performance five and oh we're on top of the ladder fuck i did not predict this i really did not predict this um another big game i cannot stress this enough i'm on a high on emotions but when I, because I calmed down after yesterday, I did do a video of me talking about yesterday and how I felt. Um, but for me, if, if I have to do best on ground, I have to say Stacey Livingston won, Chloe Malloy two, and Brianna Davy three. I think as a midfielder, she has developed so much. I'm glad that we got her over from Carlton because she has proven on why she's a really good player. For Carlton and Blue Abroad, Pommy Noz, mate, I love you both, but I have to give this girl a lot of credit. She put in a hard yard, she really made sure that the way that you play, the way you want to get the ball out of the middle, um, we were patient with the ball, we didn't try and we over handballed it a little bit, but I, I they're a lot more positives than our negatives. Now that's just a little bit of a mistake. That's nothing. That's not going to cost us for me not giving that out of you know, a 10 out of 10. So, if you're a returning magpies, like and comment. Let, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you're new magpies, please, if you like this, let me know in the let me know in the comments below like this and please subscribe if you like it. it means the world to me. I'm now, I'm nearly at 50 subs already. I, I just cannot believe my luck. Until next time, Tay family, tell your friends and boy, turn the pies because we're gonna fucking win the flag in the women's. You hear this first. I am saying we will win the premiership in the women's because we're playing that good of a footy. It's very hard to stop us at the moment. Until next time, I love you all. Bye.